Well, there it is, folks. There's our finished large forge. Um, all I've got to do is take it home, throw it in the barn, and put the blower in the tube, and uh, she's ready to go. That's not the prettiest thing in the world, but it's very functional. I'll take uh, function over fit and finish any day of the week. All it needs to do is to hold hot coal. Now, we got that, uh, that forge pot's built out of half inch plate steel. The um, two year and all that, that's built from uh, two inch black iron pipe. We have inch and a quarter square, uh, square tubing for the legs. We've got a two inch cap on the bottom with a piece of rod welded to it, and that is uh, for our clean out. Now, I didn't do a clinker breaker because I found, let me move it here, <clears throat> because I have found that I can jab a little poker in there and clear that out just fine and I like to clean the uh, clean the forge out after using it anyway so dimensions on this this is it's about five inches deep we are 11 inches across we're 13 and three quarters long that should give us plenty of room for bigger stuff. I was having problems trying to forge my hinges. For one, the uh, anvil wasn't what I was using. The railroad tracks just wasn't beefy enough, wasn't heavy enough for what I was doing. And secondly, the little brake drum forge I made was just too small. So we did this instead. Now this is one of those projects that we started last year. And I'm trying to slowly get to all those little projects that I started while I was in the middle of the barn build. Now we're trying to get some of those finished up because they are going to be necessary to the things that we're going to be doing. So, of course we're on the outside. It's two inch angle iron. So we built this so that I could pop this right out. This top right here can come off. That way we can uh, rebuild the whole thing. You gotta remember, Coal's pretty darn hot. Now this half inch plate steel will last a really long time. And I have enough I have enough of it left over to build one more of these if I need to. I've, uh, I've spoken with people who've done it out of half inch plate and they've been using it for 10, 15 years with no issues. It hasn't burned out or anything like that. What'll be interesting to see is how well that air setup works. I have a hole coming straight up the middle and then I angled my holes so that the air is going to come up the sides of the pot a little bit. We'll see how that works out. We can always we can always do something different if we need to. I can always uh, I can always drill that out and make a clinker breaker for it if it becomes a pain in the ass. So I said the be beauty of this is I can pull this whole thing out if I need to. So I'm kind of looking forward to using it and seeing what happens. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this one. It's just one of those loose ends that we've been sitting on for a long time. So I will see you on the next one.